I don't want to be mean. I really, really, really don't want to be mean. So I tried out, I'm going to share everything with you. Um, I tried out a rental clothing company because I was thinking I came out with a program um, which you can get if you attend my live event. You can register it for intoamillilady.com slash live. It's essentially how to be the best version of yourself and the secrets to a million dollar woman. But the point is of this video is that this is not even supposed to be on YouTube. I was filming, me, filming it for my program for those enrolled and I was thinking, you know, people who have office jobs or have to change their clothes a lot and want to look really put together, it can get expensive to continue purchasing new items. So I thought if you rent clothing from a high kind of place, and you pay a monthly subscription and you can get it shipped to you. You can steam the clothing. They said the dry cleaning is taken care of. So everything is perfect, right? Um, so I thought I would try this out. I thought it would be very economical for people who are tr in a job where it requires a lot of clothing changes or maybe being out and about. I thought I would spend my money to purchase a subscription and put the content in my program. So, and maybe even make it a series so ladies could see if, the rating is good or not and I filmed it and I was so disappointed like within three minutes of filming I'm actually going to share this review it was supposed to go on the program but now it's here for you to see so it's like my authentic reaction to everything um, I really don't want to name the company publicly because I just don't want to be mean maybe I got a bad batch I'm not sure let me know in the comments if you've had similar experiences but I'm gonna blur out the company name and those in my program I actually will leave it out and whoever's in my program will be able to see what the company is because I feel like it's a little bit more discreet it's not so blasted on the internet so yeah let's get into what I think about this. So I decided to do something hands-on and entertaining for this program, and that is try out rental clothing. What's inside, how it works, and show you the outfit. Why to do this, should you do this? There are many ones available. I'm trying a specific one out today, and perhaps I can make a series for this and put out other companies that I try out. But say you have an office job or a job that requires for you to continuously be changing outfits if you are in an office or if you are always out and about, sometimes kind of purchasing these things and let's say you've already created your capsule closet and it's still not enough, it can be very pricey to continue purchasing really high quality clothing and at the same time, you don't want to be purchasing from fast fashion brands because that's also not good for your image and the quality of the clothing is just very, very low and it will make you look not your best, right? So what are the other alternatives that are eco-friendly, that where the clothing is really high quality and you can interchange for a very low amount? So this is an option. So I've never done this before, so I'm really curious to see. I haven't even opened the package. I'm curious to see how it works, how it's presented. When you go to their website, I believe it's $40 per month, so how it works is you are able to select three items and then interchange them as many times throughout the month. But shipping and returns take time, so probably you'll be able to interchange it maybe once a week to once every week and a half. Well, I guess you have to wear the clothes too, so perhaps two to three times a month you can interchange, so you're getting anywhere from six to nine items, anywhere from that range, I would say. So it's really handy, let's say, if you have an office job and you have to be there five days a week, but you don't wear, want to wear the same blouse, here you have high quality pieces that you can wear and then you know wear them for a week, ship the package up, and then get them sometime mid next week. So then you are able to kind of rotate through clothes. But I wanted to actually see, is the quality as good as it is, right? So let's find out. You don't get to pick exactly which items you want. So how this one in particular worked is that you went online and you can build your closet. So you can pick eight items and then they choose which three to send to you. So this is how it looks like on the inside so far. And the shipping was a 
pretty fast. I would say I, as soon as I filled up my closet, it took about three days to get to me initially. Everything is wrapped up nicely. I will say that the clothing selection from this company in particular would not be something I would wear to a night out or something kind of edgy. And I would really recommend this more for your maybe casual errand days, more formal ones, perhaps where you might see somebody that you want to look presentable. For office, I would say these are good because they're very simple kind of business to business casual outfits. They have pants, skirts. I just picked tops for this round. But if you are kind of going on a romantic date or maybe a vacation, this in particular company is not one I would recommend because I, at least it didn't fit my style, but I think you can probably find other ones or it's for every different style, right? So I think this is great for office and more formal wear. I don't even really remember what I got anymore. So. I guess I got this turtleneck piece. I just like the color green and turtleneck. It's, it's um, quality is okay. You know, it is what it is. And taking into account that this is a worn piece too, looks pretty good. Then I got something a little bit more formal. This piece right here. And I also got this blouse as well. It's dry cleaned, it's not steamed or anything, so I'm gonna go steam these and try them on. Okay, I'm back and I'm going to be honest, I'm glad I'm doing this so you don't have to. And I'm gonna really share my honest opinion of this. I didn't steam the clothing, they're still right here because as soon as I turn off the camera and I'm kind of moving them around, they definitely have an odor to them. And it's quite potent and I would not wear this. I actually don't even want to steam it and put it on because it just smells like it's been out for a while. It kind of has that kind of wet, damp smell, you know what I mean? I'm not sure if all of the garments are like this. This is just my first batch. Maybe I got a bad one, but honestly, I would not, um, I don't even want to put it on. I don't want to wear it. I know it's dry cleaned, but you know, as far as the quality actually goes, it looks okay. It looks presentable. Um, However, the scent of this is just not something I would even move forward to unless I would actually like wash it myself, but I don't want to do that because it's supposed to come dry cleaned already. So I actually am just going to hold this here and send these back without trying them on or anything because I already would not feel the way I want to feel wearing these clothes. That's why, you know, I'm just gonna pass this one. Other companies, I'm not sure. I have not tried them. Maybe I can make this a series for this um, program where I could actually try them on. But so far with this, I'm not really a fan. It also has a tiny little defect right here. So not a big deal though, but I was just thinking for more alternatives um, for these things that it could be an alternative to rent something if you have kind of a high volume clothing job where you have to keep switching outfits. But so far with this in particular, I'm not very happy and I don't think I would, you know, I would not, uh, I don't even want to get a second order from this. Maybe I should just to see if it comes out to this, um, this situation. But that's going to be it for this short little series save your money i would say just get another garment to add to your capsule wardrobe so i will not be ordering more of this